Hi guys, welcome to VG Inside channel. Today I am presenting you the unboxing for my new Alienware keyboard and mouse that is TechX and TechX mouse keyboard and mouse both. So you see here, this is the box for the keyboard and this is the mouse. I already removed it from the box. So today I'll show you the features of this keyboard and mouse both. So let's just start with the unboxing. So now we open the mouse first. So as you can see this mouse is a 9 button mouse, it has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 on this one and 9 I don't know where actually it is. So when you power it on it has the lights over it, it has light over here, light over here and light on the alien head over here so let's now first remove the keyboard and so we can connect both of them together this is a manual same as the mouse had a small warranty and information manual this is a driver CD which needs to be connected for keyboard and mouse both. And here is the keyboard. It has a very big cable and comes with a two USB jacks. One is for the probably the backlight because this keyboard is a backlight keyboard and the other one is for the normal operation. So let's remove it out of this cover. It has a beautiful sticker over here for the alien head instead of a normal celebrity. So this is how the keyboard looks. So and this is a extension so that if you need a further support to your palm, just have to snap this thing. Two clicks and this thing is snapped. So it's a full size keyboard with uh, very very soft keys over here compared to my earlier I had a Logitech MX5500 keyboard and mouse set even this keys were soft but not as soft as this one this was a wireless one and this one is definitely a wired one but, but still like I just wanted to complete my gaming series with the keyboard and mouse set too so now let's plug it in and I'll install the software and show you the how the lighting and everything works for this one hi guys so I just stopped that unboxing and now this video is for giving you the lights effect I will darken the room so you can see the lights backlight on the keyboard 
so this is how the keyboard looks this light is can be changed into 12 to 15 different colors like the keyboard on my laptop and this is the mouse and these three lights are also customizable with the help of a software on the laptop I currently connected my laptop to my LCD TV so I'll just show you how to change the colors over here and how can it be customized further so here you can see that on the top this one when I select it will change the color on this portion of the keyboard like suppose if I set this color as a green and when you see over here on the keyboard at the bottom it has changed to from this kind white kind of light to green light let me change it to more subtle color so you can see it I'll now change it to red so now on the keyboard over here you see it's a red color similarly I can change the light from on the keyboard over here suppose I change it to different color like yellow or let's make it red also same making it same so here you see that the whole keyboard is in red color similarly on the mouse you can see it's white color as of now so let's just change it to select a mouse over here in the software and I can change the color to like red to over here click apply and here you see the mouse has changed to red color so this is uh, how you can change the colors there are a list of available colors I can keep changing let's show you a couple of colors more like suppose I change it to a green color or a blue color let's click apply so now you can see the mouse is blue similarly we change the keyboard and we change it from this to a uh, blue color over here and this color we set it to pink for suppose or we set this one as pink and this one as kind of green let's see how it looks just I'll just keep changing the color so you can just see all type of colors over here changing see like this is the one color this is the other more of pinkish kind uh, bluish kind color greenish yellow color my handicam is not able to define much of the color vividness but uh, I think I was able to make you guys very clear of the picture like how customizable the colors are and the top also I can keep changing the color like different colors over here like white color and all so this is how the lighting effects now let me just give you some brief details about the buttons on the left hand side these are the six programmable key keys one two three four five six i can program them to make open any applications or something over here is escape and normal function keys here is one switch and just show the light in the light yeah you can see the switch this is a uh, when you turn it on it means you can use it for a joystick when you turn it off like you're normally using a keyboard these are the media playback buttons this is just a light this button doesn't it's not a button over here and these are the three buttons here three buttons here for media there's a mute button these are the LED indicators for caps lock, scroll lock and num lock. 
these are the standard number of keys button over here the arrow keys the standard insert delete home and page up page down standard window key with the mouse right button over here and you can see for the gaming we normally use WASD which has been crafted by an alien language A for this, S for this, T for this and W for this so this is all about the keyboard I have to find out what are this four buttons for maybe they are programmable too and this is one big mute button you can use it to mute the volume now to the keyboard I mean sorry to the mouse and mouse you can see that this mouse has a two buttons over here this is the uh, as you can see the lights goes on and off and changes from dark to dark with this button I can change the acceleration of the mouse with the help of this button with this plus and minus so like if I feel that my gaming is going like I'm flying with the airplane I need a bit less sensitivity I can change it immediately inside the game and like if I'm just shooting around and I need more of the sensitivity I can just increase the sensitivity so you can see like the mouse is will be moving more I'm not sure you can see yeah see the mouse is moving like a bit faster over here and if I reduce the speed to minimum now you see the mouse is very very slow but now I'm increasing the speed of the mouse over here and you can see the even by moving the mouse uh, slightest I'm hardly moving it only this much and the mouse moves very fast oh yeah uh, it has a standard two buttons over here on the left fourth button and the fifth button which can be used as in uh, programming for like it can be programmed in such way that I can use it in the gaming and all at the bottom over here it's a dual scroll mode like suppose that normally the buttons is not pressed you can hear the sound the sound yeah it means that it will scroll line by line it is not a free, in a free scroll mode but if I press the button now I think I did not press the button yeah now you can hear the sound so now the mouse is in a free rolling position it keeps rolling until unless I don't stop it see this and this button is a profile button like it has a inbuilt program profiles which I can use it to set it like if I want this button to work something different this button to work something different this button is back and forward instead of opening some application something it can be programmed with an application built inbuilt with the help of the command center software so this is it all about the keyboard and mouse please don't forget to like and subscribe and keep watching for more of my more gaming stuff and videos so see you later bye